Do I have to go and come back to make it night? What is this guy doing? I would just rest <laughs> until it's like actually night out. Okay. Okay. All right, everybody's gone. Uh, what the hell? You! You've got to help me! Please help! No one around here is allowed to talk to me! I can't buy anything! No one will take my money! You can't imagine how bad it is to be considered without honor in this place! Well, if it isn't Rami the Harami... <laughs> I assume that's the, the... Did I tell you guys about that? No. Uh, go ahead. So... I don't even know how you, what you would call this, but like, because um, you know, Rami is a real name, but oh, okay. Um, I was thinking the other day, like, you know, if they were clever and they were trying to do, instead of calling him Harami, like Robert, they could have called him Rami. It's like Rami the Harami is a thing people say. I don't know why. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. like uh, I can't really think of an English equivalent. Like a person who doesn't really exist, you know, but it's like, oh, Rami the Harami is going to come sneak into your window and take your shit. You know, it's uh, like that kind yeah, of thing, yeah. like a figure, a, I don't know, figurative person, not like a real person. But, like, like a boogeyman uh, almost. Yeah, only not that serious even. <clears throat> but, you know, we have Harami instead anyway. That's that's I, the stupid thought I had the other day watching. Well, this guy is now Rami. Uh, this anonymous <laughs> one does not look healthy or happy right now. I mean, that's what being honorless does to you. Oh. Uh, hold on. Uh, oh, wait, sorry. I forgot what I was doing for a second. You make the thief <laughs> sign by patting your belly with one hand while wiggling your other hand by your nose. Hey, my name's Rami. My name is Rami. It's Kenneth. <laughs> You're one of us, huh? Well, take my word for it and play it safe. You don't want to be stuck here like me without honor. There's no guild here to help you when you get caught. Oh, okay. You don't know how good it is to hear someone say that to me. Hey, look, take care, huh? I mean, like, you're the only pal I got. I don't want to lose you. You gotta help me. <laughs> All right. Big deal, I thought. What kind of punishment is losing Anna? I never had much to do with Anna anyway. Now I know what they mean when they say without Anna. It means no one can talk to me. It means no one even looks at me. It's as if I was dead or something. You're breaking some sort of law just listening to me. <laughs> I feel a little bit better now. <laughs> <laughs> I got no place to stay except in the tents of the bazaar at night. I got no use for money. I can't buy anything. I can't even get away because no caravans are coming because of the war rumors. Okay. I don't know what to do. I'm starving. The only food I get is some meat that dog guy leaves behind at night. Jeez, it's a good Ugh. thing it's still warm at night or I'd freeze to death. I heard you was trying to stop this war. Well, I'm not much for politics, but go for it. Stop this war and the caravans will come back again. Then maybe I can get away to some place where they only cut your hand off if they catch you stealing. Because my name's Rami the Harami. <laughs> Hey, Rami. Hey. <laughs> Look, call me Rami, please. I stopped here with the last caravan, thinking to pick up a few things here and there and go on my way. Uh, this is just, my God. Like, <laughs> How was I supposed to know there was going to be no more caravans coming here? Okay, no big deal. I can make a living for a while. Next thing I know is I'm caught, and they bring up all kinds of things they say I stole. How'd they know? If I knew they saw me, I wouldn't have stolen in the first place. Do you know what this guy's name is? Harami. <laughs> yeah, literally. I'm, just, I'm sorry, I just had to show you. Oh god, this guy is like <laughs> Arab gesturing to me. <laughs> he is emoting. Help me! <laughs> <He> is. <laughs> We just did. Oh yeah, thief. Hey, hey, come on. Thief was my hey, dad. Hey, I'm a Rami. Call me Harami. 
Like, this guy's like, oh, everyone's treating me like a criminal, but please, buddy, call me robber. (laughs) (laughs) What did I do to deserve this besides my own actions? (laughs) Man, I just want to get as far from here as I can. Okay. I hear the merchants talking about war all the time. If you don't do something about peace, I'll never get out of here. All right, let's see. Since he's tired of meat. Give him the fish. (laughs) Yeah. Although I want to see if he gets mad if I give him meat. Thanks, pal. All right, I'll be nicer. (laughs) (laughs) Thanks, pal. You know, I thought at least it would be like, but a ding, but no, that's just like. Well, this does count as paladin points, and this is a way to grind honor if you so want to. Oh, is it? Yeah. Well, um, well. The, the, bro- the broken strat is to barter a lot of cheap uh, meat off of the meat merchant uh, and then just pile it on this guy. <laughs> Interesting. So how high could I get my honor? 300 is the highest possible. Oh, I can't. I don't have time to do that. <laughs> <laughs> but here you go. Okay, now is it how uh oh no oh oh that wasn't worth it <laughs> wait no give fish. me my fish back <laughs> <laughs> so he just like is here begging um at night now it, yes okay it's a little payoff for the scene you know when you busted him at the start of the game that is just so funny Everyone's treating me like a criminal. Anyway, call me Harami, man. <laughs> <laughs> I have to wonder if anyone, you know, ever told them about this. You fill this room with sunshine, he of the golden hair. What would you like today? Today we also have a specialty from the natives of this region. Pilau ya pofu? May it fill your belly well. Alright, it's not even gonna tell me. Let me guess, it's strange. Oh, Pilaoya Pofu is a mixture of rice and the meat of an eland. Eland? A large antelope native to this region. Alright. I've heard that you've been before the Hall of Justice, one who speaks with lion tours. You love these titles, girl. <laughs> I hope that the lion tours of Tarna recognize your greatness, Fendi. I feel like going down to the river tonight and swimming in the darkness. Okay. You've come from the faraway land of Shapir, have you not? There's a kata in the bazaar who's also from that land, I believe. Your words are like honey, speaker of sweetness, and I find it difficult to stick to my work rather than to- Do you think she got divorced? Like, <laughs> she's not talking about it anymore. Well, the kata it might have been would most likely be to speak with like, you about Shapir. What's that? It's like, my- just like, you know, uh, bluffing that she has a husband in order to throw you off. <laughs> I'm bringing you right out. Yeah, that's the healthy assumption to make. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, 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 she flirted. Did you see that? She flirted back. Do, do you think Do you think that, like, um, she was engaged? And then I was just, like, so sexy and flirty that she had to break it off because she couldn't, she couldn't deal with it. Sure, why not? Yeah. He of the golden hair, you know, who speaks with Kata. Oh, it's so strange, but delicious. Mommy's she like, likes oh, me, I I'm wish telling I had you. some of that strange food. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I the fact that they do it every time kills me. <laughs> it sure was weird and nasty. <laughs> Splat. Okay, it might be time for us to go find the plot. Oh, 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 that's not gonna... All right, well, time for one more weird breakfast. What would you have me do for you now, bringer of peace? You sound as if you find the Knights of Tarna chilly without someone warm by your side. I will be happy to help you get over your chill. I have a large cat, you see, who loves to cuddle. Mm -hmm. (laughs) 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 
All right, I'm just going to say and get it out of my system. I bet you got a large cat. Hey! <laughs> hey! <All right>. hey. <laughs> I'm very fine today. Thank you for asking. Your most polite voice of poets. That was more of a how you doing, but hey, all right. Hey, that pussy thing wasn't me. That was Rami the Harami. <laughs> hey! Oh, shit. No, no, no. No, tell me what the food was. <laughs> okay, 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 let's go back. Just shaking Very your fish, look. trying to get down the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> now, unfortunately, in order to preserve the canon, we are going to have to do all those dialogue options. Again. <laughs> all right. You're fine. Great. All right, there's the cat. I bet you got a large cat. Ayo, whatever it was that I said. <laughs> uh, uh, no, that's not it. Oh, menu. Okay, there we go. Today's a treat from the far north. <laughs> God. <laughs> Giraffe. <laughs> Sour cream. I'm so sorry I asked. <laughs> Fadafins are a type of... Are you... What? <laughs> you say that? Oh, I'm even more sorry than I am. <laughs> so how can you believe they did oh it to God. you twice? <laughs> it, I just I didn't think they could make it worse. I was like, wow, lamb falafins. And all this time, I was like, oh, <laughs> they're they're just frying up balls of... No, no, they... Oh. <laughs> God. So now we got giraffe pitas with sour cream. Incredible. All right, let's let's have some of that. Let's have some of that authentic, <laughs> delicious food. It's uh, it's fusion, Suha. <laughs> God, I'm like beside myself. Like, <laughs> how could they do this? <laughs> they they did not learn their lesson between games. They said, you know what. We haven't been clear on what it is we're serving here. <laughs> we're going to define this. <laughs> oh, this authentic cuisine. I love it. Oh, I bet it was tasty it was a and bit strange. strange. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to memorialize this. Well, I can't type. I'm so upset. <laughs> All right. Do you look upset? Oh, this person looks attractive. Excuse. Okay. Can I? No. All right. Fine. Whatever. I don't want to talk to you anyway. I love that there are like sad and scared people, and then there's just hot people mm -hmm. who are walking around unbothered and happy to be hot, which I guess is like what so, it's like. <laughs> question. Um, yes. Do you want me to tell you some things you might need to save you a trip back across the savanna, or would you like to figure that out on your own? Yes, just because we're on kind of a tight timeline, um, and sometimes I've been getting caught. So if there's anything, oh my god! All right. So, like, let's uh, look at your inventory. Make sure you've okay. got everything you need. Um, so, uh, okay. Um, how many zebra skins do you have? Only one, I think. You're going to need a lot more than that. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, actually, this is dumb, but I did want to see if Rakesh and um, <laughs> Krisha had anything to say about this drum. Oh, welcome back, young hero. <laughs> welcome again, my friend. Hello, Prince. Oh. I can't show it to them? No. Nope. Oh, well, never mind then. You guys can enjoy <laughs> your privacy. <laughs> All right, so, okay, okay, let's go get some zebra skins. Go up. Oh, thank you. Oh, there he is. What, what the? What? Sorry, I was trying to click to. I assume it wasn't anything important. No, was it? they just say no, hello to you as you walk past. Yeah, okay. they're like, hey, check out my fruit. <sighs> okay. Missouri Buona. Okay. Oh, all go. right. You're going to want four more of these. Okay. Okay. 
He nods in response. You pay for your purchases and put them away in your backpack. So I have five. Uh, That's the correct amount. Very good. How many fine daggers do you have? I'm assuming uh, one or two. Two. Okay, two. Two is adequate. Okay. Uh, and see, so okay, that. Um, you got that. Um, you, go, go buy a spear. Why not? Sure. I'm an open-minded guy. <laughs> I like trying new things. Okay, oops. Oh, that's okay. All right. See, every time I click it, it goes immediately to purchase. Like, they don't want mm -hmm. me to fucking. Well, they bargain. don't want you to. <laughs> Wow. I will starve at such a price. I'll listen to your next offer. Wow. Uh-uh. Oh, wow, okay. Now how many do I need of this? Just one. Okay. It is good. Okay. You are happy. Yeah. I am happy. We've done well. You should be covered unless you just want to stock up on like uh any pills for the road. I have a lot, I think. Yeah, 13. I have five mana pills, which I don't even need. Two poison cures. Do I have any stamina? That's the, um, your water skin's full of peace water. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. Should I get more water skins, do you think? Uh, I think you've got, like, six, which I think is going to be sufficient. I but... have six? Hold on, I thought I had three. Oh, I have four. four. Okay. Neither of us was right. <laughs> <laughs> I might as well. I like the sound of six. Come on, give me a real discount here, buddy. 25% off. Oh, hell yeah. It is good indeed. All right. Okay. Nice. Okay. Thank you. Now, um, the plot should be waiting for you and Simbani. Actually, real quick, I'm just going to buy some more fruit from this guy. I'm going to make him a poor man. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Mahadok, sorry, Defendi. Buy fruit. I'm going to put you in the poorhouse <laughs> with your children. It's a banana, Michael. How much could it cost? <laughs> Very well. <laughs> <laughs> You'll make me a poor man while you enjoy yourself with my fruit. <laughs> <laughs> I love how, like, sullen he is. Okay, that's good. Pottox, are you defending? I'm not talking to you. I already exchanged my money. You're dead to me. <laughs> exactly. No, 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 no. Oh. Don't start your fucking theme song up. <laughs> it's crazy to me that like um the uh, the space quest guys uh the two was it two guys from Andromeda? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Those guys got in so much trouble for so many things, but Sanford and Son <laughs> uh <laughs> stayed. <laughs> Oh, fine. Yeah, get this guy. Four right, royals. Nice. Got my some of my money back there. Okay. Oh, my fucking... All right. I do feel like I've at least gotten stronger than I was because the first time I fought this, I almost died. Mm -hmm. yeah. I wasn't in great shape, but still. Don't forget to save your game. Good idea. There Gotta we stop go. at the convenience store here. Mm hmm. How am I doing? Oops, that is not what I wanted to do. Oh, we're fine. 
gonna pet the cheetah real quick. As you do. So cute. One for the road. All right, we'll spend the night here. Wajumbo Wana. Wajumbo, buddy. Have you heard the news, Hero? Someone has taken the drum of the Leopard Men away from the Liban's hut. Who? I don't I, know who <laughs> could have possibly done I, such no, a thing. That is such a surprise to me. <laughs> oh, hi, buddy. The villagers say the Leopard Men take drum back by magic. The Liban say someone broke into his hut and steal the drum. The guard of the hut say he heard nothing. I'd be thinking we have one plenty good thief around here, and he better be hiding that drum good, or maybe he'd get caught. You're so right. <laughs> the Liban be plenty mad, but he not think the Leopard Man did this. He think a Leopard Man would kill him first, then take drum. So he'd be looking around here for the missing drum. Can you give her the drum? <laughs> I'm gonna try. The drum be stolen the other night while the Liban's sleeping. No sign of the thief but a hole in the wall. Missouri friend, but I'd be remembering things about you I not like to remember. I think maybe you'd be too <laughs> sneaky. What does she know about that? How does she know? Did, did, did Rakesh tell her? <laughs> Rakesh, you're not supposed to tell everybody that I'm a thief. I say, oh, this is new. I say, this must be communication. Missouri friend, let's see. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty high. It's 214. That's pretty cute that he's starting to pick up the language, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> Do not speak more. Remember, I'm a Simbani warrior, and the drum is now the Simbani's drum. A warrior must protect the Simbani's things. Okay, but check it out. Oh, come on. I just, I wish they would let me be stupid. We're gonna sit down together, two friends. All right, yeah, well, two let's friends. Spin line neither of us, neither of us having stolen a drum. Yeah. <laughs> the hut's been repaired. Oh man. Okay, guess it's still a bad time. I just wanted to give him back Actually, his drum. <laughs> no, no, it's too late. You said you didn't want it. That's fine. Yeah, I'm not. That's fine. I do love that they were like, yeah, the the live one doesn't think that uh, a leopard man did it. They think someone like whiter and blonder <laughs> um, and oilier did it. I'm sleeping my little. Hu Come on. You're missing the door. Go to the is door. It? There it is. Oh, thank there you, you go. God. It's sad to be in here alone. I miss my buddy. Am I missing? I'm trying to see just if there's anything else. Maybe it's up here. Go no, left. left. This way? No, I meant go left from the screen you were on. Okay. Oh. Welcome, Prince of Shapir. It be not often the Simbani have such a guest. I be the storyteller of the Simbani. I will be most interested in learning more about you and your adventures. I am certain they will make an interesting story. This seems like a bad idea, but sure, let's do this. <laughs> so, I stole the drum. <laughs> <laughs> you greet the storyteller. It be indeed an honor to deal with one so polite and knowledgeable in the customs of other peoples. You tell the storyteller about all the sweet things you did in Shapir. Asante, <laughs> hero of Shapir, I can find many stories in the words you tell. Stories be many things. Stories be lies. Stories be truths. Stories be quests. Stories be ways of looking at the world with different eyes. I have a story for you, if you wish to hear it. It'd be the story of a magic drum. 
I give you this story. There once was a people, a proud people, a peaceful people, a people who had no enemy. Then one <laughs> night, a thief stole into their village and stole their magic spear. I'm sorry for a minute. My guilty conscience thought he was saying, then when I a thief stole the drum. Now the people have an enemy. Now the people can have no peace. But who be this enemy? Who be the thief who stole the magic spear? That is not known. Then the next day, a warrior was found in front of the village of these people. That warrior was dying. That warrior have in his hand a magic drum. That warrior have on his lips a name. That name be Leopard Man. And the warrior, he die. These be the questions of the story. Why did the warrior have the magic drum? Why did the warrior say Leopard Men? Why did the warrior die? I have given you this story. <laughs> now the questions are yours to do with what you will. I thought you'd be better at this. <laughs> oh, okay. The Simbani people have many stories. Do you wish to hear the story about the warrior woman? I give you this story. Let me guess, there once was a woman. She was a warrior. There once was a warrior, okay. a mighty warrior, <laughs> a proud warrior, a warrior who was also a woman. I love this warrior, warrior, warrior. <laughs> now this warrior who was a woman wanted to have a baby. A baby must have a father. A father must have a wife. A wife cannot be a warrior. This be the way of the warrior woman's people. So the warrior woman leave her people. She travel very far. She travel where a warrior can be a wife. The people miss this warrior woman. The people miss her strength. The people miss her courage. The people miss her words. The people miss her warrior. Then one day the warrior woman come back. At her side is a small child. Yet the woman is still a warrior. Will the people learn that a warrior woman can be a wife? Will the people learn that a warrior woman be still a woman? Will the people learn that it be wrong to call a person <laughs> one thing or another, but not both? I have given you this story. Now the questions are yours to do with what you will. I love that he does like the, you know, when you read a book when you were younger and it had like um, teachers, like questions <laughs> in the back. <laughs> A storyteller be to open the mind and the heart of the listener. A storyteller knows no answers, only questions. Do yeah, you wish to I hear know. a new story? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, sure. I give you this story. Once there was a thief. <laughs> <laughs> this thief was a very skilled thief. This thief could hide so that no man could see him. This thief could speak so that no man could hear him. This thief be having no conscience and no shame whatsoever. <laughs> this thief lived in a village. It was a quiet village. It was a peaceful village. It was a village where everyone was a friend to the other. Then one day, the thief decided to steal from his own village. The thief sneaked into someone's hut and stole something. The thief was so quiet that no one could hear. The thief was so sly that no one could tell he was the thief. Now the village be not a quiet village, for everyone accuses the other of being a thief. Now the village be not a peaceful village, for everyone thinks another is the thief. Now the people of the village have no friends, for every man may be an enemy. Did the thief gain something by stealing, or did he lose? I have given you this story. Now the questions are yours to do with what you will. I don't know why you're telling me this story. I don't know anything about what you've just said. One questions, is stealing bad? <laughs> <laughs> Did you listen to the story I told you the other night? I can give you many questions to ask. Why was the magic spear stolen? Why would anyone want to start a war? Who will be the one to answer these questions? Could it be you? <laughs> I give you this story. Once there was a village in the middle of the savanna. All the people of this village worked in the daytime. All the people of this village despised magic. Once there was also a village in the middle of the jungle. The people of this village worked in the nighttime. The people of this village despised those without magic. One day, something was stolen from the village of the savanna. 
one day something was stolen from the village in the jungle. <laughs> Each village knows the other is the enemy. Each village wars against the other to gain back what was stolen. The question is, <laughs> be, be war worth it? <laughs> is killing good? <laughs> who is the bad village and who is the good? Are we the baddies? I have given you this story. <laughs> now the questions are yours to do with what you will. Be we the baddies. <laughs> be we the baddies. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, 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 no. My dude, storyteller, I just wanted to play some Awari. You know what? I'll see ya. <laughs> Bye. What stories? May your, may your life always be filled with questions. Here's a story for you. God damn it. Yes, of course. Where'd I get this drum? You know what, though? You're right. No, he'd be like. <laughs> be it wrong to steal a drum? <laughs> Who gives the drum back? If the drum was already stolen and was then stolen again, was it truly stolen? <laughs> what day is it on your calendar? Uh, that's a good idea. I thought that was just a rhetorical storyteller question at first. <laughs> what day is it on anybody's calendar? You'll probably want to go back to the village, see if something triggers, um, or maybe progress this, another this day. This village? Yeah, the Sambani village. Okay. It's finders, keepers, losers, weepers. Truly, truly, truly. <laughs> uh, why, why can't I go in? Okay. You got an ant. Fine. Oh, I'm in excellent health. For now. I mean, I better be. Go back to sleep? It doesn't seem to or... have triggered yet. Yeah, like save, try to progress another day and see if uh, we actually get what we want to happen. Like, I'm pretty confident we've done all the prerequisites. You might be able to just, like, sleep it off now I don't, from the, inside the village if you don't want to risk getting anted. <laughs> um, I believe the term is getting antsy. Ah. Oh, come on. I should be allowed to sleep if I want to. But it's okay. I can just go stand outside for a second. I'm a hero. I should I should be able to sleep the entire month away. I'm not just a hero. I'm an adult. I can make my own decisions. All right, that's enough. Mabari Buana, buddy. Hajumbo Buana. I mean, Hajumbo Buana, buddy. <laughs> I swear my communication stat is really high. It totally is. Goes down five points. <laughs> <laughs> Is there still a rotting fish in your chest? Oh, good uh, question. Oh, no, no. It's fish jerky. Oh, oh no, never mind. You took Yikes. it. Oh. <laughs> okay, Habari Buana. Well, this is the day guy. Mm. The other guy was the night guy. Oh, that's right. Oh, for the God. Does she still want to be in the village, David? Um, our next plot point should be um, a somebody in the cage in the village. Unless I'm forgetting a flag for something. I mean, it's possible that you have to, like, uh, do all the, like, exercise stuff with Uhura, but I don't think that should be necessary as a thief. Well, I thought I did do that. Well, you, like, I uh, got her to give you the tutorial, but you didn't actually compete with her with, like, the, um... Oh. Habari, Prince of Shapir. Good to be seeing you again. Yeah, yes, yeah. a man who wants to play board games. <laughs> I am not going to give it to him. I won, so you can... and we're keeping <laughs> it that way. You can try uh, do climbing on top of the... Uh, exercise walkway here and seeing if Uhura comes by and challenges you. Okay. 
starting to remember why I don't like Quest for Glory 3 as much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now I do have to do this. I mean, am I just amazing at this? Like, Well, you've got all these something? dodge buttons that you're not needing to use because you're not competing. Oh. Yay! Wow! <laughs> da 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 da! <laughs> yeah, I, that's fine. I don't care about you. God, my throwing is so sad. <laughs> <laughs> Feels like kind of inconsistent. But I guess my stats aren't very good. That's oh, my stamina is not doing good. Yeah, yeah, thank you. No, no. Yes. Okay. Oh, yeah, I made it. Okay, good. Just make sure I had all that. Okay, maybe this is what we're missing. Um, it might be necessary for you to go to as far east as you can go to get a special That's encounter. That's actually what I... Why do I have two of these? That's actually what I was thinking um, prior. Uh, just... It's what I would want to do anyway, since they kept saying, oh, go east, go east, so... Oh, it's still early. Fine, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Am I getting any benefit from all this fighting? I mean, you get your stats up. But I mean, am I? Like... <laughs> Strength? Oh, okay. But that's it? Now, your weapon uses are almost close to the cap. Um, okay. Uh, you don't do much dodging. Um... This roaring is so funny. Because <laughs> it just sounds like a scream sometimes. Mm -hmm. Okay. I like that they introduced this camping mechanic and you're always very determined. No, I'm going to go where it's most comfy. Well, yeah, I like to be, you know, safe and cozy and, and happy. <laughs> Look at that. It smells good here. Yeah, it's beautiful. The, the very air invigorates and revitalizes me. Mm -hmm. This place is like, well, totally awesome. Why would you not want me to sleep here? <laughs> Look how happy I'm going to be. Look at that. Oh, wow. If only I had a strange breakfast, that would just complete the package. Seriously. <laughs> this doesn't count as food, right? No. Dang. Listen, Irana did not make the heart of the world, so... Yeah. Irana's piece is like the exact oops, kind of place I would have, uh, you know, just been obsessed with as a kid. Mm -hmm. I mean, I already love it as an adult, but... Can I go down from here? Oh, good. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Back on the road. We get down here to the the very last screen. If we can get by uh, these ants and leopard men. 
Like, sometimes the animation hasn't finished, but I just keep doing it and their health keeps going down, so... I've just been going for it. Oh my god. <laughs> Can, can we... <laughs> God. He just wanted to throw, you know, magic bolts at you. I do appreciate the JoJo posing going on here, <laughs> um, you know, many years early. I mean, JoJo was out at this time in manga form, but... Wow, ten royals? God damn. I'll take that. I've got to stop doing that. There we go. Okay, this could be better, but fine. All so right. it's going to break 200 soon. Nice. Weapon use also getting close to 300. Love that. All so right. our friend Wilco says, love that. Big fan. Got a point there. So we need to wander around until we get a little special event. Okay. No. I, okay. I was... No, I wasn't safe. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Sure, I'm a very buona, buddy. You see a monkey, a monkey trap. trap. You see a monkey in the tree. You say hello oh, to monkey. the monkey. Oh. David? Mono see, man friend. Man friend, no see, mono. Mono up in tree. Mono here. Hello, man friend. <laughs> Oh no, did I finish all my fruit? No. I uh, know you got apples. Oh, right, okay. Really? But he's a monkey. I know. I'm, I, yes, I, I, I am up in the tree still. <laughs> Are you going to talk to him? I'm trying to. Oh, wait. Okay. You're talking you're going on yourself. There we go. I'm sorry. I thought I wasn't. It said they're not interested or something. Jungle Manu home. Jungle monkey home. Tree is good place. Ground bad place. Many bad things eat monkeys. Many bad things catch monkeys. Trees best place for monkeys. Jungle's best home for monkeys. <laughs> monkey Manu. Mono big monkey. Mono smart monkey. Mono like man friend. <laughs> Mano see big fruit on ground. Mano get big fruit on ground. Trap get Mano. Mano very sad. <laughs> Mano not happy. Mano plenty dead real soon. Man friend come. Man friend break trap. Manu free. Mano very happy. Mano like man friend. Hey, oh. Bye. Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn, okay, so I guess I can't do anything with that. Anyway? No, you just gotta, you know, free him, and then you can have a conversation with him, but he just, you know, decides to leave, because he's a monkey. Yeah. Monkeys live in Monkey Village. Monkey Village and tall trees. Mini monkeys. Monkeys fun. <laughs> monkeys good. Uh, man friend like monkeys? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> you know, you ask a lot of questions, buddy. You're like a storyteller. <laughs> All right. Hopefully that is what you needed to do to progress. See, in my brain, I thought, like, we could do this, just do this whenever. Lean back is so funny. Also, the way the loincloth flies around. Wow, poor. <laughs> Call that starva time. You can't cross the river. Oh, okay. I know it's tempting. There's all those like geometric shapes over there. 
What the hell? My <laughs> God. It's time to prove yourself. The battle begins. What? Oh, what is this? It's just a little, little demon. Oh, okay. Holy shit. Oh, did I win? Mm -hmm. Yes. I mean, did it die? Okay. Oh. Got some rocks. Does that, does that count? Yeah. As what? Like, did I, yeah, you, did I kill it? Yes, you did. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's just like it left. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Who needs monster energy drink when you've got Arana's peace water? <laughs> Arana's sprite. Arana's sprite. Oh my god. <laughs> See Rana missed. Oh god. <laughs> Actually, this is a Sierra game, so would it just be Sierra missed? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, is anyone coming or? Am I being stalked? Aha. Oh, it's just a guy. <laughs> wow, this dodging is incredible. <laughs> He's serious. I like the roaring personally. <laughs> <laughs> and the growl when he dies. I love that I found one on his break so he couldn't leopard himself. No. There we go. It's more like it. Please let me leave. You might want to sleep for the night. Yes. <laughs> the explosion. Oh, I made it. <laughs> and you're getting tired. Yes, just in time. Can't wait to go six screens up to get to the water. Totally worth it. You'd think they could at least give you a shortcut, you know. They don't expect you to ever want it, to go back up here again. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> I need my hotel room. Well, yeah, that's exactly what this is. Look, look, look at that. Every time. Yeah. I feel that good every time. Every time I hear that opening harp chord, I think it's the death music from Space Quest V. <laughs> Rick, if the Simbani has not uh, progressed to the next plot point, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fine. I got this. I'll just find the storyteller and he'll ask me some more really thought provoking questions like, you know, who's who's the bad guy here and why was the spear stolen and who stole it? These be the questions. Oh, I'm a clown. I forgot to refill my water. Why does cargo move by ship, but shipments go by car? <laughs> Oh my god. You'll never be free. I really won't. Like, this thing uses so much stamina. I can't wait to give Sadim one single horn and then he'll tell me he'll never take anymore. <laughs> it is true that you will not need more than a single horn. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, great. Wonderful. <laughs> I'm so strong and awesome. All right, let's go. Dead ant, dead ant, dead ant. <laughs> oh, I feel better already. Can you believe this, Cheetah? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, yeah, I saw you fight like five random encounters right of an eye shot of the pe in the pool here. Cheetah sees you coming up and just growls, Hard life, Mac. 
Uh, Let me use this better. almost to maximum. Which one? Oh, weapon use. Oh, yeah, nice. Now, why is my communication higher? Is it because I like, talk to the monkey? Yeah, Possibly. I hope it is. That's amazing. <laughs> I mean, that was hard work, you know. Mabari Buana. Hujambo. Oh, there you go. Have you yet seen the prisoner that our warriors have caught? We do not usually have prisoners in our village. Mostly we kill our enemies outright. But the Lybon wishes to find out where the Lipperman village be hiding. Yar. <laughs> <laughs> if ye could make the Lipperman to speak, then maybe we can tell us where he we find his village. It is difficult <laughs> to find a hidden enemy. Avast, Lepermen use magic and hunt at night, so they have never been a friend to the Sambani. It was only when they stole a spear of death that they are be our enemy. <laughs> I love this new direction you're taking. <laughs> the spear of death be plenty powerful. It be the weapon of the Lybon and the symbol of the Sambani warrior. To lose such a thing be a great dishonor. Yar. Yar. <laughs> Shiver my timbers. Leppermen use magic and hunt at night, <laughs> so they have never been friend to the Sambani. It was only oh, when shit, they sorry. stole our spear. I did not realize that was the same thing we already said. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. The Lybon is a very wise man, and many people respect him, and he is very cute. <laughs> uh, God, was that village? We Sambani will easily defeat the Leopard Men. We be brave warriors, and they be but cowardly magic users. We we simply haven't done it yet, because we didn't <laughs> feel like it. <laughs> but when we do, it'll be a long battle. We'll be fighting for Yars. <laughs> <laughs> Missouri Buana, I be well. I be full of pride for the warriors of Sambani that have captured the prisoner. They will win much honor by this. Go and speak oh, to the captain. That's, that's so cool. Okay. Wait, I mean... Missouri, Buana. Kahere, Buana. So now the cage should have a nice little prisoner. You see a Simbani warrior standing guard. You see a leopardman prisoner in the cage. The guard shakes his head to say he doesn't understand you. Perfect. The guard's like, I still don't under... No, no. Uh, you, it's a matter if you say it slower, <laughs> I still can't understand you. Uh, you say Habari to the guard. The guard replies, Missouri Buana. Well, I'll just have a conversation um, on our own then, shall I? <laughs> that you will not understand. The prisoner snarls oh. back at you. You say Quahari to the guard. The guard replies, Quahari Buana. I thought I was talking to the... Okay. I thought it would be so funny if I was if, if he was snarling at me, and then he goes, uh, Quahari Buana. Hmm... <laughs> 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 Okay, well, uh, probably don't need to save, but let's try some shit. Yeah. What do you think you could do here? The Leopardman reaches for the sculpture, then draws back from you and snarls. Okay, maybe you need to lighten up a little first. Okay, no? Alright. Okay, not. Okay. Okay. What? An, inap 
inappropriate offer. Okay, sorry. Hmm. The dispel potion is the correct response, unless I'm forgetting some context here. Try leaving the screen and coming back, see if it maybe fixes it. I hesitate to say go to sleep because uh, this guard is the optimal guard to get right now. Okay. Okay, there's a leopard man prisoner in the cage. He seems like he wants this leopard, but he doesn't want to touch it. Maybe save your game and progress to the next day and maybe talk to the Libon first. Let's see if Uhura says anything. Missouri friend. Not speak more. Stop telling me about the drum! <laughs> Suha, can you do something dumb for me? Yeah. Can you put the lips on the hero's head? No, just like <laughs> where his mouth would be. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought about that. I needed to see it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, poor Simba is just <laughs> not gonna... That's weird. I thought she'd... This is just regular conversation. Hello, look at the prisoner the warriors caught. Now maybe we can make the leopard men give back our spear of death. Uh, did he look like this last night? Or was he in human form? Um, the leopard men? This is what yeah. they look like. Okay. The prisoner will be fed and watered in the evening. Do not bother him. Should I waste time? Um, try talking to the Libon and then maybe uh, waste time and see if you can get the other guard. Look at the magic okay. of the Leopard Men. It turns them into animals. That is the way of magic. The prisoner tried many spells to get out of the cage, but the cage stops the magic. It is good. The warriors found the Leopard Man when the light first filled the sky. He be trying to spy upon our village. The Simbani be too smart for him and he be caught. Maybe we trade this leopard man for the Spear of Death. Maybe we make him tell us where his village hides. Either way, the Simbani will gain back the Spear of Death. I help the warriors drag this prisoner to the cage. The leopard men fought very hard, but we are Simbani. I wish I was playing a warrior right now. <laughs> Missouri, Prince of Shapir. You know you want it. <laughs> Try the live on. Okay. The drum was stolen while I be sleeping. The elders say it must be leopardman magic that steals the drum away. I do not know. If it was a leopard man, why did he not kill me while I was sleeping? If it were not a leopard man, then who <laughs> else would want the drum of magic? Somebody do not steal from their own people. When I find the thief, that thief will be killed. Oh, well, that I don't know if that's necessary. <laughs> <laughs> we have already greeted one another. Comedy I'm drum sorry, beats in the so background honorable. every time the hero <laughs> moves. <laughs> this leopardman spy was caught at the edge of the savanna. We will keep him caged until the spear of death be returned, or when we learn from him where the leopardman village hides. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's the greatest weapon. We'll kill whatever it's the it is. It'd be the pride. 
Okay. The spear is so great, but the drum is so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> the Leopardman prisoner will be guarded at all times. So far, he will not talk and tell us where his village hides. When he does, the Simbani will destroy his village! Yay! And return with the spear of death. <laughs> Can't imagine why he's not talking, though. <laughs> I don't get it. If you can find the Leopardman village from speaking to the prisoner, then the Simbani will have their Spear of Death back, and the war will be over! Go then, and thus bring peace to this land. Go on! <laughs> Scamper off, kid! Man, fuck the Libon. <laughs> <laughs> well, there right. he is. We got, we got our optimal guard. Optimal guard. <laughs> I don't know, I don't speak your language. There we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> it is time for a new girlfriend save file. <laughs> the card makes a sound of surprise. <laughs> what? <laughs> Humming a what? <laughs> a g -g 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 lady? <laughs> you see oh, an attractive young right. woman in the cage. You see a Simbani warrior standing guard. <laughs> <laughs> the leopard lady turns her head and ignores you. Women, am I right? <laughs> okay. I love that he's still like, I know Spico, <laughs> like every time. <laughs> there, how about a how about a nice fur coat? You? No? Okay. Perhaps I could interest okay. you in some fine ze oops, so, got some fine zebra pelts. Let's go see if we can, uh, talk to the live one about this new uh, revelation. Okay. Uh, uh, no. Hey, hey, turns out the leopard man's a hot <laughs> leopard lady. This changes everything. <laughs> now that you have turned the prisoner into a woman, she will stay in the cage until she tells us where her village hides or when somebody buys her for a bride. Her husband will soon know where the village be and we will have the spear of death again. Already my son, Yusufu, has asked for the bride price. I do not want him to marry an enemy, so I have set the uh, bride price high. Say no more, my man. I will help you with this. <laughs> I will do it. It seems that you have can use magic greater than the Leopardman, Missouri. You will help us regain the Spear of Death. Yeah, absolutely I will. Okay, the drum was stolen. Somebody while stole the drum. The price I set for the prisoner is high, for I want the husband to value her and not let her escape. Also, I do not want my son Yusufu to wed such a creature. See, she is an enemy of the Simbani. I will set the price at <laughs> one fine robe, one fine spear, and five zebra skins. Bet you don't have that in your pocket. <laughs> oh my god, would you believe? <laughs> wow, I mean... What are the chances? <laughs> as soon as you mentioned new girlfriend, I thought, oh, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, there we go. All right, well, Mubari Buana, buddy. No, no, I, I mean... You tell about how you used the Dispel Potion. Missouri, now she will tell us where the Lipperman village be, as a prisoner or as a wife. Everyone Our knows that really we're married. <laughs> you have to tell, you know, your husband everything. Be it a prisoner or a wife, but really, what's the difference, right, boys? <laughs> <laughs> Marriage, am I right? <laughs> we'll, we'll use our sexual wiles to get what we need out of her. <laughs> Oops, what the hell? I only clicked once, sorry. We are done. It. Get out of here. Let's just see if he says something different. Habari, Missouri. Uh, really? Oh. When you have 
When you have given me the bride price, then you will be married. You'll find it most interesting to be married to a wildcat. I accept your bride price, and the Loverman prisoner is now your wife. Oh, um, okay. I didn't realize I had to just do that. Okay. Now we can get out of here. Get out of here and go, like, tell her to tell us where the spear is. All right? That'd be Why awesome. Why can't then I the say then bye? Be... I just wanted to say bye. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, new wife. I don't know. In my culture, you are known as waifu. All right, there she goes. Uh, The guard says something you can't understand, but you don't think it is flattering. (laughs) (laughs) Wait, (laughs) we're... (laughs) <laughs> just opening and closing the cage like mm. women well, can't live what? with them past the beer nuts <laughs> <laughs> oh, oops that's the wrong save oh that's what he was saying okay yeah quite hairy okay 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 so 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 I don't think you, you have lady. her in your possession me and you baby no? Okay. You, you need to pay the bride price first. I know, I just, I want to see if there was anything different, but alright. Alright. This time we're going to do it from our inventory. Can I offer you this fine robe? You're going to find it real interesting being married to a leopard lady. Dang, I don't know why I'm just upset that they don't give me the, the chance to, like, click everything on him. <laughs> It just feels nicer to do that. All right. Okay. All right. Now. Now, was that a doom state or no? Uh, letting her go before um, figuring this out is a doom state. Okay. This is lovely. Do not think, though, that it'll make me your wife. <laughs> there we are. <laughs> Can you tell her anything? Okay. No. Oh. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> hey, greetings, guard. <laughs> okay. Well, you're my wife now, so. I'm gonna feed you apples. I know this <sighs> is very strange food. Perhaps a, a horn? No. Is that all I can do right now? No. Uh, You need to continue piling on your Dragon Age uh, friend gifts right now. Damn it. Perhaps a fish. (laughs) No. Can I interest you in this fine drum? Some rocks? (laughs) (laughs) Let's see, what do I have? I've got royals. Fine dagger. Grapnel hook. Thief's toolkit. Tinderbox. Uh, mana pills. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna show us those. Fish, fruits, beads. Oh, wait, yeah, here we go. The leopard lady holds the beads for a moment, smiles, then puts them away. Okay, okay. How do you like me now? If this is Harvest Moon, she'd probably have a green heart by now. okay all right so you don't like that how do we like this no okay we don't like that perhaps some fine olive oil (laughs) Hmm. Do not think I will not use this on you someday. Still, it is a very nice gift. Oh my god. So I've given her a beautiful necklace. I've given her a leopard statue. And I've given her a fine dagger. Would you like a second one? (laughs) No, you, you wouldn't? 
Okay. No, you just gave it or away. Did that count? Okay. Okay, so I just have the one. Yeah. So Perhaps you've given her the appropriate tender. gifts. Okay. I can let her go uh, now. Yeah. I just love that nobody thought of this happening. 